In our second problem, we've been given the area of a circular plot. Um, it's 135th or 135th of an acre circular plot. We've been uh, looking now to calculate the radius in feet uh, so that we could go out and measure it out and actually install this plot. And so we need to start out here with the formula for a circle, which we know is area equals pi r squared, where r is the radius, a is the area. And so I need to solve this for r. I'm going to start by dividing both sides of the equation by pi. Area over pi equals r squared. And then from there, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get rid of that square on r by taking the square root of both sides of the equation. So I end up with square root of area over pi being equal to r. So that's the general form of the equation I need for this problem. As we saw with our earlier problem, problem number one, my area here is in acres, and I'm going to need that in square feet, so I need to convert. And we use the same process we did in problem one. One over 35 acres times our conversion, which is given to us here, uh, 43,560 feet squared per one acre. Look at my units, they cancel out. So that goes and that goes, and I'm left with units of square feet. And so this equals 1,244.57 feet squared. So now I have area. Pi is a constant, 3.14. And so I have everything I need to solve this problem. So I'm going to plug this number in here for area in this equation. And so what I end up with is 1,244.57 divided by pi, which is going to be 3.14, 159, et cetera, and take the square root of that. Now, if I'm doing this in a calculator, I have to remember order of operations. I need to take 12,444, sorry, 1,244.57, divided by 3.14159, take that quantity, which is going to be about 400, then take the square root of it, and that is going to equal 19.9 feet. Is our answer. I didn't put units in over here, but we noticed that that has square feet. So this numerator here is in square feet. Pi is unitless. And so I'm simply taking the square root of square feet, which leaves my units at feet. And that's the solution to that problem.